Hey y'all, Matt here from RetroOnly.com. Today we're going to be talking again about the Nintendo Switch. And more specifically, I'm going to be answering the question in this video of how many controllers you can connect to your Nintendo Switch. Before I hop into that, please be sure to hit that like button and then also subscribe to our channel as it really does help us out a lot and also allows other people have these exact same questions about their Switch console or their other gaming problems to get their questions answered as well. So we appreciate it if you like and subscribe to the channel. All right, so when you're looking at your Switch and you're trying to figure out how many controllers you can connect to it at once, it's important for you to just pay attention because that's the easiest way to know for sure. Now, if you don't own a Switch yet, that might be a little difficult, which is why I'm making this video for those people who have this question, but haven't actually purchased a Switch yet. On the Switch itself, if you look at the controllers, you'll be able to see these little lights that are lit up. And that is the player that is, this controller is connected to. So player one will be the light at the top, player two, player three, player four. If you'll notice, there's only four. That's true on all of the controllers that you have for the Switch. This one's same. You only have four lights. The reason for that is because there are only four people or four players allowed to be on the Switch at one time. You can't connect any more players than that at once. Now, you can't connect more controllers than that. For example, for some of the videos that we just recently did here on the channel, I have purchased a bunch of different controllers and I connected all of them to my Nintendo Switch, but I didn't have all of them connected at the same time. So say for example, you have friends over and each one has a different controller. So you invite three friends over, you have your controller, a total of four controllers connected, all of you can play, not a problem. And then the next day you have four, three different friends come over. They can then connect their controllers up and also play. So that's not an issue of having more controllers connected to your Switch, but connected at the same time, you can only have a maximum of four controllers connected. Let me go ahead and hop into the Switch here and show you exactly what I'm talking about and how you can know that there's only four and not just take my word for it. As you can see here on the Switch itself, there is only a spot or location you can only have four controllers. So you only have one through four available. And I'm currently on the pairing screen of the Switch. As you can see here, change grip order. And that's the maximum number of controllers that you can have, which also means that's the maximum number of players that you can have on any of the Switch games. Now, being that there's a lot of games on the Switch that are great for multiplayer, for example, Mario Kart is a great game that you can play with tons of different players. You can still only have a maximum of four. Same thing with Mario Party, same thing with other games on your Nintendo Switch. It's only a maximum of four players, which is kind of annoying, but that's the way that Nintendo went ahead and set it up. So as you can see, you can only have four different controllers connected to your Switch at the same time and no more than that. I hope that this video has been helpful to you. Again, my name is Matt from RetroOnly.com. Please remember to hit that like button and then also subscribe to our channel as well. Have a great rest of your day.